I've managed to find quite a rare bird in the middle of this field. It's the kind of bird that you need a trained eye to spot or, or a decent zoom on your camera or a pair of binoculars because this is a bird that's always hunkered down on the ground. Here it is, this is a grey partridge. And grey partridge are a lovely bird to see. Now, they're originally a bird of uplands, but when farming was it become a big thing with the clearing and the fields it, and the closed off hedgerows around the fields, it was a chance for partridge numbers to be boosted and they managed to spread across the country. But then farming tactics changed, it got mechanised, hedgerows got taken out, fields become bigger and partridge were more exposed. Uh, they were predated more and also herbicides were killing out the weeds that grow in the fields. Um, it was fields are becoming a real monoculture crop and so this was the food source which, for grey partridge which is flies, um, insects and seeds and leaves. Um, the food was disappearing and combined with the combination of hunting as well as a game bird uh, and basically those combination of events have now led the grey partridge to become a red listed species. These birds have declined by 80% in just 40 years so the site of some grey partridge is a real treat and here they are in Thanet, just four of them. As I say they're strictly a ground bird so you know that Christmas song you were singing not long ago? You will never see a partridge in a pear tree. Cheers guys, be wild.